channel. I hope that the message finds you while you're in good health and good wealth. Hope that you're doing something that you love today. How you guys been? <laughs> Long time no see. Thank you, spirit. We're going to check on the current energies. See what comes out. Can you show me? We have the Knight of Pentacles out first with the Eight of Wands on the bottom and the High Priestess. You're being guided. Your intuition is guiding you towards something that you want to do or a certain direction that you want to head. It seems like something you're ready to invest in or something that you are <clears throat> trying to be methodical about in regards to how you approach it or how you move forward with it. Could be anything. Could have to do with your finances. Um, but your intuition is kind of propelling you <clears throat> to take action or take a specific action. And you could be very slow moving with how you're responding to that intuition. But it's almost like you found the key to something, right? You see on around his neck, he has like this key. Um, <clears throat> so I feel like you figured something out. Maybe the direction you want to head. You're definitely dedicated and you're ready to... I guess, buckle in for the journey. The Seven of Cups. Yeah, for a while, you could have been very... You could have had a lot of different options or ways that you could go about whatever this is for you, right? There's something here clouding your judgment or in regards to this answer you found, maybe you've just un, you know opened a lot of doors for yourself because you are taking action now. You know what I mean? It's kind of giving me the energy of like... <clears throat> I don't know. We all have dreams, right? We all dream big at one point or another in our life. And in order to find the key, you got to know, first, you got to know what you want to do, right? You figured that part out. You know what you want to do. Um, you're in the process of manifesting, but with the magician in reverse on the bottom, followed by the seven of cups, this could have to do with getting page of cups reversed. This could have to do with getting the right opportunities or not feeling like you're getting the right opportunities. Maybe something about belief in self or one's own abilities. There's definitely... You know what you want to do now. And so now it's like you got to figure out, okay, how are you going to do it? You know, and what do you need in order to do this thing or those things to achieve this goal or um, manifest that relationship connection? You figured out what you want to do, and now you're trying to figure out how to do it. You're emotionally invested. A little bit confused. Page of Wands, but you figured something out now. Nice. I feel like you're very excited for this. There could be a certain message coming in at this time with the Page of Wands, bottom of the deck, Wheel of Fortune, Eight of Pentacles. There could be a, um, a specific message that kind of helps bring you clarity or some sort of communication, right? But with the Wheel of Fortune here, it tells me all of the time that you've been investing into this thing, this idea, um, being methodical about whatever this is, right? It's paying off. I see a lot of excitement here. You going on a new adventure and things shifting in your favor or things turning in your favor, starting to at least. Um, especially in regards to if this is like a work thing or the Eight of Pentacles, I don't know. You're very good at something, very masterful at something or becoming masterful. <clears throat> it seems like you're on this new adventure, <laughs> Page of Cups, and the opportunities are starting to show up. Um, this could be also somebody apologizing. This could be you apologizing. I don't know. Page of Cups, it feels like a good opportunity in this case. With the King of Swords... Yeah, you got clarity now. You used to be confused, now you got clarity. The Ace of Wands on the bottom. So what I'm seeing here for you. <clears throat> you're feeling excited about something. You're feeling alive. You're feeling like you you want to take action towards something, right? Ace of Wands. I think I said Ace of Wands. Ace of Wands is all about... Um, it's all about your passion. It's all about your energy. It's about feeling um, revitalized within your energy. Some of you guys could have a lot more energy to do things, right? Maybe for a while you were kind of like moving slow, a bit confused, stagnant. But in the center with the Page of Wands here, 
You, the idea that you were looking for, the direction you were searching for, you found it. And you started taking steps or action towards it. And now the opportunities that are coming towards you are opportunities that um, either you take very seriously or they're just like, they're exactly what you were looking for. There's a lot of clarity here. Almost like your time spent being methodical and taking things slow, it was well worth it, right? Because these are opportunities that your heart is open to or invested in. Things that feel genuine and sincere, but also opportunities that you're well equipped for. You could be some sort of leader or <clears throat> this could have to do with um, maybe your voice or communication in any way, shape or form, right? But you're definitely well suited for this. No ghost. Hi, baby. Hi. Ghost just woke up. <clears throat> stop, stop, stop. Not that. <laughs> All right. Overall energy. You're taking action. You're doing something. You're excited about it. There has been some sort of transformation or transmutation, right, of your energy from kind of like confused and stagnant to more so like, all right, let's go get it, you know, let's go make it happen, you know. I feel very good about this for you. <clears throat> King of Cups on the bottom, on the split, strength reverse. In regards to relationships, what can you show me? We got the Nine of Cups. Some of you guys could be doing your own thing right now, content doing it. <laughs> being single or I don't know it could just be a wish fulfilling connection yeah relationships you are <laughs> you're in love with the money I don't know there's some sort of balance here um, maybe there was a bit of conflict in the past that is now being resolved with relationships or connections in your life um, but yeah things are being balanced out in your relationships I just see a lot of it's either you putting in work towards a relationship that makes you happy or it is you being happy doing your own thing and just working on towards the things that you want right either way whatever it is for you it feels like there's been peace brought to the chaos what else can you show me about <clears throat> love or relationships the nine of pentacles yeah some of you guys are just single <laughs> like you just focused on bettering yourself, your life, your peace of mind, judgment. This could be ending soon, <laughs> your singleness, the lovers, yeah. Yeah, okay, the ace of swords, okay. So right now you might be in this like in-between place of being single, doing your own thing, manifesting your dreams, goals, but there is uh, a certain connection here that seems to be popping up that will be very fulfilling for you or just very en energetically aligned with you. It might pull you out of this independent place, right? But either, I don't know. It's not very stressful. There's a lot of success, clarity, truth, ace of pentacles, and it's new, right? So that feels good too. <clears throat> Goals. <laughs> but How is your nap? God, we're good. Go. All right, let's get you some closing messages. Butterfly, a change for the better. Beetle, good fortune. Yeah, I, I don't know. I feel like you're in a good energy. Very revitalized. Um. You also have August. You could be a Leo. Have any Leo in your chart. Uh, I think that's Virgo. Virgo at the end of August. Yeah. Yeah, Virgo. You should accept valid criticism. Great worry over nothing. Triumph over troubles and obstacles. Solid foundation. Success with effort. A distant friend is thinking of you. New job, new career, and good luck with the sun. Happiness and well-being. Strong emotion, passionate love or hate. Caterpillar. 
things will not always be this way. A change is coming and that change is for the better. So I see a sense of direction. I see you being content with where your energy is at. I see you manifesting more, growing your confidence. I also see potential connection showing up here that means a lot to you or that will be very energetically aligned with you. It feels good. It feels like you're getting your groove back. You're getting um, more clarity in regards to the direction that you're heading. That's what I got for you today. I hope you guys all have a great day. Good health, good wealth, all the good jazz. If you want to follow me on social media, donate to the channel or book a personal. Links will be in the description box below or my about tab. I'll see you soon. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>